Yes, sir. Good evening, ma'am. Hi, ma'am. Call. Good evening. Yes. How are you today? We call myself Ms. Arpita, faculty of Button Computer Tutorials. I will be handling English, Mental Ability and Intelligent for you guys. Okay guys, in the previous session we have completed with the conjunction chapter. Now we will move on to the very new concept called as adverb. Okay. This is applicable for all the three exams that is now that you are signing as well as RMS also. Let us see what is the definition of adverb, what are the types of adverb and how the question will be arising on it. Okay guys. Any news? Yes, it is adverb. If you have any doubt, you should ask me. Wherever you get the doubt, please chat me in the chat session. That is doubt. D O U B T. I I can help you and I will talk to you. Are you all ready to listen today's class? Yes. We will move to the very new concept called as adverb. Now, what is the definition of adverb? Now, see, an adverb, an adverb, an adverb. Is a word. An adverb is a word that modifies that modifies modifies a word. A adverb is a verb that modifies a verb. An adjective. An adjective or and adverb adverb itself okay this one is the definition of adverb this is the example look at the example now see an example is this is this is very this is very famous famous book See in the above example, which one is a adverb? Very is a adverb, and then the famous is the adjective. This is about your adverb. Look at the second example. He runs. He runs slowly. He runs slowly. What is the verb beyond? Adverb beyond? Adverb beyond runs. And then slowly is your objective. This is about your definition and then example. Look here. An objective is a an objective is a word that modifies the verb. What does mean by verb here? Verb is nothing but the action verb which modifies the verb. We will call it as adverb. Okay. Next, modifies the verb. An adjective or an adverb. Okay. This is the definition. Example, this is very famous book. In the above example, very is an adverb and then famous is an adjective. Second one, he runs slowly. Runs is an adjective and slowly is an adjective. Take down. Any doubts in the definition and example? What Achit? What is your problem? May I know your problem please? I am sharing the board up. You can see the board right? I'm here itself. Leave the session and join again. Any doubts? Board is blur. Huh? Now, what about now? I think it's fine. Yes, it's completely fine. I can see here itself. Can you repeat again, please? Where were you? Okay. See, the next very concept for your chapter is adverb. What does mean by adverb is nothing but 
Pritam, leave the session and join if you are not uh, able to see. Okay. What are the types of adverbs? The first type is adverbs of adverbs of time. What is the first one? Adverbs of time. What it is used for? See. Okay. What is meant by adverbs? They tell. They tell. They tell us us when action when action takes place when action action takes place. Okay, this is about you know the first type of you know, adverb that is adverb of time. It tells about when the action takes place. Okay, for example, what is the example now? See. I went I went for a movie yesterday for a movie I went up for a movie yesterday which now it tells an action which action when it takes place it takes place on yesterday and then second example what is the second example Vicky finishes his task Vicky finishes its task Finishes its task. Its task early. When he finished, that is early. This is about your the first type of adverb. The type of adverb. For example, what are the words you will get here? Ago and then after, after, early and then yesterday. And uh, quickly, quickly, recently, I'll write here. No, I'll write here. Press words. Recently, recently, and then today, today, and then tonight, tonight. And then tomorrow, and then tomorrow, etc., etc., are used for adverbs of time. Okay, see, guys, this is the first type of adverb. The first type of adverb is adverbs of time. What does it mean by adverbs of time now? See, that tells us. When the action takes place, at what time the action is takes place? It's not till really exactly about the time that is seven forty, six thirty, like that. It is like I went for a movie yesterday. It shows an action yesterday. I came to school early, like that. Okay. It takes place when it tells about when the action takes place. For example, I go after early yesterday, quickly, recently, today, tonight. Tomorrow. This are the few example I have given to understand you people. Copy down this. Any doubt? My voice is echoing. Pritam, leave the session and join pa. It's not coming. Yes. Take down. Take down soon and let me know if you have any doubt. Ishita and then all new students, Rudra, Tapshak, understanding what I'm teaching. Take down first. Yes, it, here also it's raining. Hmm, yes, take down. Take down first.
completed how many of you are writing still body is blur 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 i think it's proper because of the segment issue now is proper yes achut doubt ah rudra you should not text whatever you want there achut what's your doubt What do you mean by none of this? It's not. Ma, I am. Ma, ma. It's what is the meaning of none of this? None of this is nothing but which is not there in the group. Okay. What is the in relationship between the time and not there in the group? Huh? Okay. Yes. Okay, ma. Hope you all understood. I think so. I move on to the second type now. The second type of adverb. The second type of adverb is nothing but adverb of adverb of adverb of manner. Adverb of manner. Okay. What does mean by adverb of manner of the piece here? That tells about. the tells about the tell us how the tell us how or or in what in what in what manner in what manner an action an action takes place in what manner action takes place okay this is about your this one second type that is adverb of manner i will give you the example okay see sita speak sita speaks sita speaks english english sita speaks english fluently no and clean okay see you fluently what is the uh, this one manner she speaks english very fluently the second one the second example second example read the instruction carefully read the instructions read the instructions read the instructions carefully Okay. Look, your carefully is an example. Some of the examples are peacefully, peacefully, and then fluently, quickly, quickly, and then certainly. Most of our ending with L Y, and then loudly. Loudly, next gladly, smoothly. Gladly means very smooth. Gladly, and then badly, badly, and then fast, fast, etc. Fast, etc. This will be examples for examples for adverb of manner, etc. Some of examples for the same. See the second type of adverb that is yes, loudly, loudly, yes, loudly, yes. Most of the 
adverbs ending with ly okay adverb of manner is nothing but they tell us about how or what manner okay arpitam am teachers english very slowly like that okay i don't know what you think hmm? they be how or when what manner does action take place okay see i be handling class smoothly i be handling class roughly on what manner on a scale like that okay most of one in that most of they are ending what ly see see how speaks english fluently and then read the instructions carefully this is about your adverb of manner and this all is some words to understand the people okay there are three words except there are some words take down any doubt yes slowly can you see the board properly somewhat where it is repeated hmm. any doubts any doubts yes pavan it is because of raining adverb of time and adverb of manner yes oh yes 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 it will come in both also quickly quickly ranjit Take down first. Is it completed? Read the instructions carefully. Take down first. this one adverb of manner they tell us how or in what manner an action take place they tell how or what manner an action take place sita speak english fluently read the instructions carefully and the examples of some of the examples of carefully quickly so time me loudly gladly badly fast etc shall i move on yes ishika yes you can write ishika you can write very good everyone completed shall i move on to the third type if anyone is writing that is what i am saying most of the word ending with ly is the example of ad adverb of manner bharat acharya you should be little fast okay hope you all completed thing so i move on to the third one now third type okay the third type of adverb is nothing but adverb of adverb of adverb of adverb of frequency 
adverb of frequency what is mean by adverb of frequency let us see now say they tell us they tell us tell us how how a fun action a fun action upon action take or or event or event takes place takes place okay this is a verb your adverb take of frequency example how to how to practice us how to practices maths maths regularly regularly and then second one nandu nandu will come nandu will come again again this one is about your adverb of frequency and some more the example of the words are see often regularly regularly and then ever ever and then again again frequently frequently and then always always and then usual usual this for the example for third kind of as adverb of an frequency look here the third type of an adverb this nothing but adverb of frequency it is used to tell us a fun action take even or action a fun and then it comes in the future this a fun before repeat it comes okay this is nothing but a fun action or event takes this look at the example appo practices regularly he often and often doing this event or action so next one nanda will come again she come again like say some of the examples are often regularly ever again frequently always usually etc any doubt frequency frequently one and the same yeah often action the last word action any doubts any doubts now any doubts never yes never is also example leave the session and join but if you can't see it please there is nothing on the right side if i take right side only the action word will come okay now it's fine okay yes take down first is it completed we'll move on to the next time take down take down first okay take down take down rudra takshak danush 
Samarth understanding? Yes, good. Well, shall I move on to the next one? Please kindly raise your hands if you are writing. Hope. Hope you are completely writing. So, I move on to the fourth type of adverb. The fourth type of adverb is adverb of place. Okay. Adverb. Adverb of place. Okay. What does this adverb of place? Let me see here. See, that tells us where an action takes place. That tells us. That tells. That tell us. Tell us where an action. Where an action. Where an action takes place. Okay. Takes place. Let us see. For example, for example, she took, she took, she took the lady, the lady inside. Where well, which place she took inside like that. And second one, Arjun searched for water everywhere. Arjun search for water. Searched for water, for water, for water everywhere. Everywhere this one, okay? Everywhere. And then some of the words are near, near, and then for, for, away, away. Inside, inside, and then everywhere, everywhere, and then anywhere, anywhere, etc. etc. are used for the adverbs of noun. This is your four type. Then you got this voice. Okay, the fourth type of an adverb is adverb of place. What they tell us about? They tell us where an action takes place. That is inside, outside, everywhere, like that. Okay, an adverb of place is say, say that is preposition. Yes, very good. When it takes place, okay, they tell us where an action takes place. Example: She took the lady inside. What is the place there? Inside. And then Arjun search for an action. Water everywhere. Okay, you got that near, far, away, inside, everywhere, and then anywhere. Except for in some of the example for adverb. Take down any doubts. Take down now. This the last word. This one is everywhere. E v e r y w h e r e everywhere. Yes, some very good answers. Yes, Samarth. I have shown you. Takshak, raise your hands. Any doubt, Takshak? Yes, Takshak, you have raised your hands. What's your doubt? Rudra, understanding what I'm teaching? Take down and let me know once you have done with it. Takshak, am I audible to you?
done how many of you are writing still can your no pa your there yes yes good pragna neeta ji rudra there is a fruit yes it tells about the place ताक्षक मैं यू नो व्हाट्स योर डाउट हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू आर स्टिल राइटिंग completed abiram no need his druhan in this session no okay is completed pa how many of you are writing Akshat, let me know your doubt in the chat session, please. Jitan, Ikshita, Yuktesh, any doubts? Okay, Ragna, Ragna, take down first. Good, good, Jitan. Ikshita, any doubts, pa? Okay. Hope you all done my thing. So I move to the next time. That is fifth time. Okay. The fifth time for adverb is adverb of adverb of. It is you already learned. Okay. Adverb of. Quantity, adverb of quantity, and or extent, or extent, or degree, or degree. This is about your fifth time. We can say it is degree or adverb of quantity, or we can say it is degree of extent, or we can say degree of adverb of degree. What is this? The tells. That tells, that tells, tell us, that tell us to, to which extent? Okay, which extent? Which extent? An adjective, an adjective, an adjective is modified. Okay. Adjective modified on which extent? Okay, whether it is good or it is bad, whether it is comparative degree like that. Okay, for example, for example, your pen is too nice. Your pen is too nice. Okay, it tells the degree too nice like that. Okay, second one, pura is pura is Little pura is little short. Okay, pura is little short. This is the, some of the examples for adverb of quantity is nothing but partly, partly, and then fully, fully, and then pretty. All adjectives. Okay, pretty, almost. Almost, very, very, more, more, much, more, much, any, any, none, none, and then little, 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 and then etc. Little, etc. Or the some more. Examples for adjective of degree or quantity. 
or uh, explain or give all adjectives all adjectives can be used as the adverb of quantity okay yes it is quantity see the fifth time has sorry the fifth time is the fifth time that is adverb of quantity extent or degree and this is the last time what is it is used for that tells about what exit is too dirty is too too dirty that is too brilliant on what extent a person or a thing is based on okay you have finished two lines and then four of this little short all the adjectives can be used as the example some of the example partly fully pretty almost very much more none little etc this saw the examples for adverb of quantity take down sachin is because of raining it is raining so take down up oh. any doubts is too short yes any doubts a very easiest chapter where you can score out of 4 in this chapter and very small chapters to this completes your adverb chapter okay yes this is com this completes your adject adverb chapter a very small chapter and very easy to understand okay okay guys i repeat once i repeat once we have started with a adjective chapter Isn't it, guys? We have started with our chapter name called as adjective. What does mean by adjective? It modifies a verb, an adjective or a sub or a adverb itself. There we have seen five types of adverb. What are the types of adverb now? Wait, 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 wait. Am I audible now? Am I? Yes. Can you? See? I I think you can see me now. Okay. Can you see me now? Okay, guys. We have started with a chapter called as adverb. What does mean by adverb? It is a word. Okay, which modifies a word. Or an adjective, or an adjective itself. There are adverb itself. There are five types of adjective adverb. The first one is adverbs of time. The second one is ad ad adverbs of manner. The third one is adjective of frequency. And the fourth fourth one is adjective of place. And the last one is adjective of ad adverb of place. Okay. Let's do a little count. What mean by adverb of time? It takes one the time takes place. Okay, and the second one adverb of manner. Adverb of manner. At what manner does the action take place? And then adverb of frequency. Adverb of frequency is nothing but it repeated. It keeps on repeating frequency is nothing but and then adverb of place is nothing but where it takes. Okay, where whether it is inside, outside, everywhere like that. And the last sign that is place. It is also called as adverb of quantity, adverb of extent, or adverb of degree. All adjectives that are comparing to degree, all everyone of the example for adjective of quantity. Any doubt in this chapter? This completes your fifth ch adverb chapter. Okay. In the next session, we will discuss question and answers about the adverb chapter. Yes, Tusha, what's your doubt? Done na ah, sorry. Okay. Any doubt in this uh, chapter?
everyone let me know if you have any doubt now i'll unmute you you should not talk no one should talk okay okay guys with this uh, we have completed with a chapter called as adverb okay in the next class we'll discuss the question and answer session on adverb chapter okay thank you for attending the session thank you all bye bye